Long ago, two races ruled over Earth, human and monsters. One day, war broke out between the two races. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Many years later, MT Ebot 201X. Uh, legends say that those who climb the mountain never return. Undertale. Hello everyone and welcome to Undertale. I wasn't oh okay I'll just uh this is uh I wasn't ex really planning to play this on the channel so um so early into its launch even though it's been like a few weeks but whatever. I've just been following this game ever since it came out, and I've been really enjoying what I saw, so I decided to buy it, and on Impulse, I am playing it now, here, for you, and for me. So yep, here we go, Z, enter to confirm, X or shift to cancel, C, control, menu, and you can full screen, escape, HP is zero, you lose. So, uh, besides, like, just what's going on, like, it's an RPG, and that it was a Kickstarter game, I don't really know much about this game. But I, I also know that there are also, uh, depending on how you play, there are, uh, just, there are different, um, there are different ways you can play, and different outcomes that can happen. And, if you enjoy, if you haven't played this or have seen it before, and if you enjoy it, enjoy what you see in the first few parts, I highly recommend you play it for yourselves because this is definitely an experience that you need to, to uh, just have firsthand. Name the fallen human. So this is, uh, let's just go with um, just my my username, I guess. Even though it's clearly a girl, it was a girl, I think. <laughs> I, I, clearly, I think. Yep. Let's go with Nigal. Is it an Yep. Let's go. And if you hadn't guessed, the person that uh, tripped in the cutscene, that was us. And now we're here. So let's go head in over here. What seem? What is this? What, what's, what's over here? Oh. Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hmm. You're new to the underground, aren't ya? Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul. The very culmination of your being. Your soul starts uh, off sweet, but you can grow strong if you gain a lot of level or love. I don't. What the LV stand for? Why love, of course. All right, so it's love. Uh, you want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll show some with you. Wink. <laughs> Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. As you look to the side, I'll... Wait, why, why won't you look at me? Why won't you look at my heart? When you say that, are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can... Uh, um. Oh. You idiot. 
In this world, it's kill or be killed. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Die. Uh, oh, oh no. Oh, oh. I'm back at full health. And... <laughs> that flower just went soaring. What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor innocent youth. Ah, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see it as if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. So, at first that flower wasn't really our friend and or guide tutorial. Maybe this person? This goat woman shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. Our HP was fully restored. Okay. Let's go this way. We make our own path. Except, not really. Uh, welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruin. What do you mean, new home? I just fell down here. Why? Mm. The ruins are full of puzzles, ancient fusion between the divergent and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Okay, so if I just... That didn't do anything. Uh, only the fearless may proceed, brave ones. Foolish ones both walk, not in the middle, not the middle road. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Don't worry, or do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Press E to read signs, but <laughs> I already... <laughs> okay, stay on the path. So the dialogue in this game is very, just, very charming, it's very it's funny. So, I wonder, I wonder what switch it is. This one? Okay, that was a guess, lucky guess. Okay, um, uh, um... Go with this one. No, no, no! You want to press the other switch. I even labeled it for you. <laughs> she seems so disappointed. <laughs> Splendid. I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. Ah, she's great. Toriel's great. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. So you want me to talk to this inanimate object, Toriel. Yeah, all right, sure. You can count the dummies. We got fight, dummy, nah, act. Uh, and then we can check and talk. Uh, items. N Nothing. Mercy. Spare and flee. Well, she wanted us to talk to her, so let's talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for a conversation. <laughs> Toriel seems happy with you. Aw, oh, yeah! She's happy with us. Ah, very good. You are very good. Well, thank you. There's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. What is this? Alright, let's do this. Can I talk to you? No. Now? Yeah, maybe? Oh. Oh no, Frog attacks you. Uh oh. Um. So she just said uh, to talk, have a compliment. compliment. Yeah, alright. Frog didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Frog. <laughs> oh. Give him a death stare. Oh. Uh, the western room is in the eastern, uh, the western room is the uh, eastern's room's blueprint. Okay, so, this path, uh, this thing, well, this is, um, the answer to the next room, right? Ooh, spikes, uh, mm, can I, can I get through? I, I can lead. No? Alright, this is the puzzle, but, you just take my hand for a moment. Oh. 
This is really adorable. Toriel is great. Tor Toriel is fantastic. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. I, I guess. You have done this uh, excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request for, uh, to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Oh, well. Um, can I leave? No. Well, I guess we're just going then. <laughs> and by the way, this will be a longer part from the others, because it's the first one. And we gotta go through everything before we um, actually start the game. And we just really want to just chunk that in to uh, chunk most of that into the first part. What is it? What is this? Um. Uh. Oh. Hi. <laughs> Greetings, my child. Do not worry. I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. I noticed. <laughs> Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I'll give you a cell, a cell phone. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? So, we got a cell phone. We can say hello uh, about yourself, call her mom, and flirt. <laughs> Let's just say hi. This is Toriel. You only wanted to say hello? Well then, hello. I hope that suffices. Hehe. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Toriel is great. So you got stats, level 1, no attack, no defense, <laughs> stick as a weapon, a armor, bandage, uh, items. And uh, what I said earlier about um, about how there's different uh, things that you can do and it'll affect the game. I will go through this, I am planning to go through this game uh, multiple times just to show off what each of those are. You want to say hello again? Salutations! Is that enough? <laughs> One more time. This is Toriel. Are you bored? I should have given you a book to you. Uh, given a book to you. My apologies. Why not use your imagination to divert yourself? Pretend you are a monarch. Rule over the leaf pile with the first fist of iron. Can you do that for me? <laughs> she's just. She's like our character. She's like our mom. <laughs> Let's ask about her. So uh, this Toriel, you want to know more about me? Well, I am afraid there is not much to say. I am just a silly little lady who worries too much. Yeah, you do. Um, yeah, she, like, she is like our mom. But, uh, let's flirt. Let's see what that does. Huh? Huh? Oh, uh, heh, heh. Ha ha ha. How adorable. I could pinch your cheek. You can certainly find better than an old woman like me. Um, let's let's play again. Oh dear, are you serious? You don't know if this is pathetic or cheering. <laughs> um, if you if you ask to call her mom before you flirt with her, she'll bring that up again, which is nice. It's a neat little thing that they do. This is Toriel, huh? Did you just call me mom? Well, I suppose. I would, oh, would that make you happy? To call me mother? Well then, call me whatever you like. Alright, we'll call we'll, we'll call you Toriel, but in our hearts you are the mom. Hello? This is Toriel, you have not left the Oh, oops. There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try to solve them yourself. Be good, alright? I, I left by accident. Um, hello you. You ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, it might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight you, please use some mercy, human. Ribbit. Well, um, thanks, frog. Ooh, what's this? It says take one. Yes. Alright, we took one. We got Monster Candy. Monster Candy heals 10 HP, has a distinct non licorice flavor. Alright. We don't need to take 
another one. We'll, we'll play by the rules. Playfully crinkling through the leaves slowly with determination. HP fully restored. Sweet. Now let's head down here. Oh no. Uh, I started to just rush through this earlier, which is my bad. So we got check, compliment, and threat. Let's check him. Attack 4, defense 5. Life is difficult for this enemy. <laughs> Revit. Now we gotta avoid, we gotta avoid these, like uh, Flowey said, we had to, we had to collect as many as we can, but in, all, um, in reality we had to avoid those things. Rugga doesn't seem to know why it's here. <laughs> let's, uh, let's compliment him. I didn't understand what you said, but we're splattered anyway. Blushes deeply, Ribbon. Aw, ooh, those flies, oh, ooh, so, uh, let's dodge them. Seems we're like to fight you. Oh, it's fair. If their name I didn't show, but if their name is yellow, that means you can spare them with the, uh, or the spare button is yellow. But it doesn't always necessarily need to be yellow. Wism, Wimson approaches meekly. So look, we can already mercy it if we wanted, but I'm gonna check him out first. Terrorize or console? <laughs> Let's check him out first. Attack 5, defense 0. The monster is too sensitive to fight. Forgive me. Uh huh. And it doesn't even go for us. We, it just like flies by us. <laughs> Wimson is fluttering. That's fair. You won. Yay. Hello, this is Tori Elf. No reason in particular. Which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Uh, cinnamon. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. Ring. <laughs> Hello, this is Toriel. You do not dislike butterscotch, do you? Oh. Uh, I know what your preference is, but would you turn up uh, your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right. I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. I'm. We're not being. We're. I'm sorry, Toriel. We're sort of not. Three out of the four gray rocks recommend you push them. <laughs> Three out of the four gray rocks. Ooh, frog. Okay, so let's, let's compliment him. But it was flatter anyway. So that's pretty much the game. You just, if you find enemies, you just, uh, you uh, dodge its attacks. And when I said that, oh, ooh, oh, 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 oh. Aww. All right, so the path is down here. If you if, if you didn't see, uh, please don't step on the leaves. And we already stepped on them. This is my bad. Oh. Okay, we could just mercy him. So the path is down here that you have to take upstairs. I was I was following you for a bit. I sort of um, sort of misstepped. Right there. I think it's, it was like this, right? Oh, Wimson, please. All right, I got a place to bleat B. So three of uh, three of the four rocks. Oh God, mall mold small. So we can already mercy him, but we'll check him out anyways. Attack six, defense zero. Stereotypical, uh, curvaceously attractive, but no brains. Burble burp. avoid him. Uh, let's... So we can flirt and imitate. I actually want to show show off all these. You lie immobile with mold small. You feel like you understand the world a little better. Burble burp. Just gotta avoid these. Not too hard for the first ones. Try flirting. You wiggle your hips. Mold small wiggles back. What a meaningful conversation. Slime sounds. <laughs> Oh. Oh. It's ruminating. Well. <laughs> yeah. There we go. And. Whoa there, partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm? So you're asking me to move over? Okay. Just for you, pumpkin. <laughs> um. Can you move a little bit more? Hmm? You want me to move some more? Alrighty. How's this? Oh. 
Uh, that was the wrong direction. Can you? Yeah, can you? Can you move? That's it. Oh, there you go, buddy. Thank you. Was that helpful? Yeah, it was. So, excuse me. Uh, you want? Can you stay there? Yeah. You're giving me a real workout. Thank you. Oh, aren't things easier when you just ask? Yeah. Yes, they are. <laughs> Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole to get the cheese, it fills you with determination. And the cheese has been here for quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Oh. Ooh. Hello, ghost. Z Are they going yet? <laughs> this ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. Move it with horse. Well, we have another choice. You gotta keep going. Here comes an obstabluke. And when I said that, um, depending on how you played, it uh, affected the game. Uh, you can either fight or act. That's those are the, the the choices really. So you can fight and kill, or you can just try to be a passive player and just you know uh, not kill and be friendly with everyone and that's sort of what I'm going for this time around so let's check attack 10 defense 10 this monster doesn't seem to have a sense of humor oh hi I'm real funny oh oh cheers I'm so blue is staring into the distance let's cheer him up patient smile <laughs> Really not feeling it to it right now. Sorry. <laughs> so this game is just really funny. Uh, now it look, looks just a little bit better. Let's cheer him up even some more. Little joke, yeah. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh, that was close. That that, was, that one was pretty hard. Change seems to have improved. Now to Luke's moved again. One more time wants to show you something. Let me try. I call it Dapper Bluke. <laughs> Do you like it? Yeah, aw. That's a nice hat. Yeah, I like it. Oh, gee. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around, but today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Not go over there yet. Uh, we got 5G. Spider bake sale. All proceeds go to the real spiders. Unfortunately, oh wait, uh, we don't have enough. Oh, oh. but uh, if you bought from here, you would get a spider donut, and if you bought from here, you would get spider cider, and they both heal. And obviously, the one that had uh, that costed more would be a lot more uh, HP restore. Ribbit, ribbit, sigh. My friend never listens to me. Whenever I talk, they see up through the, my words by pressing X. That's right, pressing X. Well, at least you listen to me. <laughs> ribbit, ribbit, I heard using F4 can make you have a full screen, but what does F4 stand for? Four frogs? I have only seen a maximum of three frogs in this room. This is troubling, to say the least. Ribbit. Ribbit, Ribbit, I have heard you are quite merciful for a human. Surely you know by now, a monster wears a yellow name when you can spare it. What do you think of that? Very helpful or it's bad? When I first saw this, I thought it said very, it's helpful, bad. And I didn't understand it very. Uh, it's very helpful. It is rather helpful, remembering sparing. Remember, sparing is just saying you won't fight. Maybe one day, you'll have to do it even if their name isn't yellow. Oh, nope. hello, I just realized that it has been a while since I've cleaned up. I was not expecting to have come to you so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might see something really like. You'll want to leave your room in your pocket. Um, you want to leave room in your pockets for that. Can I? Can I talk to her? 
Yeah, we can still get torture. Alright, wait, hold on. Nope, alright. There's just one switch. Let's start here first. Oh, it's up there. We found a faded ribbon. And if I remember, that is... Armor. Defense 3. If you're cute, your monsters won't hit you as hard. We're pretty cute, so we'll equip that. What did our bandage say, though? That, that was our other piece of armor. Heals 10 HP. It has already been used several times. <laughs> so it's a healing item. And here's another ghost. Oh! Never mind. Luke, oh boy. Uh, check. Pick on him. Don't pick on him. Let's check him out. Attack chicks. Defense 6. Don't pick on him. Family Eyewalker. Or family name Eyewalker. Luke Skywalker. <laughs> oh, that's what it is. It's a pun. It's, it's Luke Skywalker. <laughs> Please don't pick on me. Alright, I won't pick on you. Finally, someone gets it. This game is like all. Oh, it reminds me a lot of Earthbound. Now that we didn't pick on him, we can mercy him. But I also think it might have gotten inspiration from a Mario and Luigi series, I think. I fell down a hole, now I can't get up. Go on without me. Wait, ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh well. Alright, <laughs> good talk there, buddy. Let's check out this, because there was a vegetable or something, a carrot, right? Yeah. A vegetoid came out of the earth. Detroit attack. Six defense six. Serving size one monster not monitored by the USDA. Farm locally, very locally. Ooh, oh, gee, oh, that was close. Cackle softly. Um, let's dinner. You pat your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. You eat greens. Oh, so if you saw there, there was a green thing that I had to pick up, and now we can uh, mercy it. That one is a hard one though. I don't like fighting the Vegetoids. Just because sometimes trying to get the green is really hard to make or reach. If I remember correctly, there was like a glitch or something that I did in the demo. I don't know if they fixed it. Alright, yeah, but like when I was coming out of the hole here, I would be on the other side of this wall. So I'd be out of the room entirely. And I had to, <laughs> I had to walk all the way back. Um, from the other side to be back in the game. Let's, um, let's dinner again. Now, if you um, if you take damage, like there, the green will heal you. Let's just not let's not fight him. Nope. All right. I didn't want to take as much. Um, let's go. The far door is not an exit. It simply marks a rotation and perspective. So, if you are confused about that, if you walk into this room, you can see that uh, it's the exact same room as the one up there, but since it's a different perspective, uh, there are different, uh, the, the levers are hiding behind the, the pillars here. If you can read this, uh, press a blue switch. Oh. A vegetoid came out of the earth, and we got some of them, some other guy here, a Migosp. But, uh, let's just talk with him first, or no, dinner with him first. You pat your stomach. Which would offer a healthy meal. Eat the swarm, eat your greens. Ooh. And if you notice there, uh... Since we have two enemies on the field, both their attacks appear on the same screen. So, if you, uh, it can get pretty difficult. Let's spare Vegetoid now that we got him. 
Cha cha cha. And the reason I saved this Megas for last is because uh, it seems evil, but it's just with the wrong crowd. So whenever it's with someone else, it'll attack you. But if it's fine, if it, if you leave it last and it's by itself, it doesn't have a care in the world. So we can just straight up mercy him now. There we go. I say mercy, but I just I should just start saying spare. To switch, press it. Yes. So the blue one was back there, and if we go over here, it's the same room again, but different perspective once more. We can read this. We'll press the red switch, which is up here. Oh no, a pair of vegetoids. Nope, not dealing with that. No. No. Damn it. Come on. I don't want to fight you. Please. No. There's just so much going on. Thank you. Switch press it. Yes. Your clicking sound. And last but not least. If you can read this, press the green switch. If I remember correctly. God damn it. I might need to use bandage? Yeah. This is kinda gooey. <laughs> I really needed that. Now can I flee please? No. I'd rather just avoid all of those without having to go for the greens. Yeah, I'm out of here. The green one is right here. Now usually that would have just let us trade into a circle, but now we are over here. Let's not head up there yet. Ribbit, ribbit, just between you and me. I saw Torio come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too imitated by, uh, to talk to her, Ribbit. So we got the city, uh, the city or something. Which is where she got her, uh, her groceries. Found the toy knife. Have you saw I was playing on Steam? I thought I logged off. Whatever. I think uh, that'll be it for now. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time for more Undertale. I cannot wait to play more of this game. <laughs>